Brief DVMs coming at you today with an update on how we're doing for progress down in the sump area. And today we wanted to show you what we've done with our UV sterilizer. We really like UV sterilizers, um, but we really don't like them on our tanks. Uh, we actually like them in our quarantine tanks. UV sterilizers can actually do damage to some of the good and healthy bacteria in your system. And in this case, we use the Emperor Aquatic Smart UV 40 Watt. We've used this um, setup for years. These guys have made a great product that we've been using um, the last uh, four or five years with great success. These sterilizers are very easy to put together and they have a large contact surface and a large contact time depending upon how you push the flow through them. And that makes them um, actually very, very good at killing algae and different types of protozoa. A lot of UV sterilizers are just too small to do anything. And in this situation, we have about, oh, I'd say a 15 to 20 gallon um, QT tank, and we're going to be putting the 40 watt on it because with our flow rate and our wanting to kill just about every algae and protozoa that we can in that QT tank while there's fish and coral in it, um, this is how we're going to do it. So this is the UV sterilizer in place. I've got some hoses to hook up. As you can see, the uh, QT tank there made by uh, Synergy Reef is almost all ready to go. Um, it's got its life support and stuff on it. And now with the UV sterilizer added to the back of it, it will be ready to uh, run for when we want to put fish in it for the next 30 days before we put them up into the tank. And of course for coral also. This is a nice UV sterilizer, folks, and we highly recommend it. But we only recommend for our clients, family, and friends UV sterilizers on our QT tanks. They can wreak havoc on our systems otherwise. They kill off even your coralline algae. Thank you for watching, folks. We appreciate that. Please like or subscribe, and uh, we'll continue to put out great videos like this. Thank you.